Hey everybody, I am Rockin' Robbie Billups. And I'm John Hamdan Holsch here. And we are the Pop Culture Philosophers, and it's time for another PCP on the spot. That's the show where you ask us questions, and we give you answers. So anyway, we got a question on YouTube from Icy Cold Milk, who I like to call B-Dubs. Shout out to you, my bro. He wants to know, what is your favorite, my bad, who? Who is your favorite Robin? Hmm, I... The, the, the sidekick to Batman, obviously. Who is your favorite Robin? John, me and you, we're both big DC Comics fans, especially Batman fans. My real name is Robin. So, let's answer the man's question. Who's your favorite Robin? I'm going to go with Damien. Mm. As much as I do love the original Robin, who is now Nightwing, and I actually like Nightwing. I think Dick Grayson's great. I look forward to him eventually taking the mantle. Yeah. Or I did. Now I'm going to go with uh, Damien. I know that some people think that he's a little... Uh, abrasive maybe a spoiled brat but he is such a badass he is and it's cool to have uh, batman mm. actually have a son to have a kin to have a real child and he it's so awesome i love them as a team you know every time i get this question i give a different answer but it's always one of two it's damien sometimes right now i think damien's just under other writers' hands, because he was created by Grant Morrison, and in other writers' hands, he really starts becoming this very cliched, two-dimensional character. And I want a, a fully fleshed, like, three, four, eleven-dimensional character, you know? Peter Tomasi does a great job as well in the Born to Kill story. I like Damien, but I'm going to go with Tim Drake, especially in light of recent events oh. in Detective Comics, if you know what I'm talking about. Tim Drake is fantastic. Let's look at the original continuity. He was the first Robin to wear pants. That's that's a big plus. <laughs> He's the first Robin to put black on the outside of his of his of his cape. Great idea. So it looked really cool. Just super cool. His costume was really dope, right? And also the first Robin to figure out that Bruce Wayne was Batman. He figured it out and he he wanted to be Robin. He wasn't picked because he was you know, found because his parents were horribly murdered in front of him, or because he stole the hubcaps off of the Batmobile, which shouldn't even be possible. Just going to say that. So, I go with Tim Drake. He's super smart, and really, I think he's the most like Batman. He's the most like the detective. I guess all the Robins have a different part of Bruce's personality, and Tim Drake is that incredibly intelligent detective. He's the Sherlock Holmes aspect of Batman. I really like Tim Drake. Like I said, first Robin to wear pants. That's what I'm going to go with. I love Tim. You can't go wrong with Tim. Tim's awesome as well. I mean, I don't really think you can fault any of the Robins. Maybe Jason Todd's... Uh, okay. But otherwise... Well, you know who our least favorite Robin is. But anyway, this was about our favorite Robin. We got Damien. We got Tim. Damien, a very, very, very close second. Sometimes he overtakes Tim just a little bit. Just It just depends on what's going on and how I feel at the moment. Anyway... B-dubs, thank you for the question. Please let us know, guys, down below who is your favorite Robin and give us some more questions for future on the spots. You'll get a shout out in a future video. I've been Rockin' Robbie Billups. I've been John Hammertime Holsch. We are the Pop Culture Philosophers. We thank you for joining the Army. Please do like, share, and subscribe to this podcast. And join us at popculturephilosophers.com for podcasts, blogs, and a whole lot more. Catch you next time.